Adamonan, officially the municipality of Adamonan, Tagalog, Bayan ng Adamonan, is a first-class municipality in the province of Quezon, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 63,432 people. It lies on the eastern shore of the province, 173 kilometers, 107 miles southeast of Manila. Adamonan is bounded by the municipalities of Gumaca, Plaridel, Pagbalao, and Padre Burgos. Barangays Adamonan is politically subdivided into 42 barangays. History There were conflicting stories on how Adamonan got its name. Some concluded that the name Adamonan originated from a tree known as Adaman alleged to have been prevalent in the area and had reportedly served many uses to the residents. These trees are now extinct and its non-existence could not be accounted for. Others say it came from the words atin muna, signifying a policy, unity of feeling and sentiments among the residents that bolster their spirit in the fight against their enemies during that time. But the most popular version is that it originated from the name of its founder, Simeona Mangaba, known to her town mates as Eight Maning. She is a woman reputed to be of unquestionable leadership, which the people regarded as their adopted parent, leader and protector. Eight Maning was the eldest sister of Francisco Mangaba, the first captain of the town. She founded the town on February 4, 1608 along the banks of the Big Maling River, now known as Adamonan River. Living along the river bank, the people has always been a prey to Moro attacks and so for fear of Moro reprisals, the inhabitants decided to transfer to Palsabongon, now a barrio of Pagbalao, Quezon. However, the people felt discontented in Palsabongon because the place abounds in wild crocodiles that from time to time disturbed them. So, after two years of stay, 1610, they left the place and transferred to Babiav, a part of Adamonan. They settled in Babia for almost 14 years, but transferred again to another site called Mananukan for some unknown reasons. In 1635, they again transferred to another place called Basita, but some families separated from the majority and settled in Yahweh, now San Isidro, a barrio in Padre Burgos, Quezon. The next year, when Simeona Mangaba learned of what happened to the original group of settlers, she, together with Fray Geronimo de Jesus, a Spanish friar, tried to unite them once more and convinced them to return to the place where it was first founded. The place known now as Bagambayan, this was during the time of Captain Pablo Garcia. Today, Adamonan is a fast-growing town known for its cleanliness, beautiful beaches, many historical and natural scenery and most of all warm and peace-loving people. On December 23, 1941, the occupation of the Japanese Imperial Army forces entering the towns and landing beaches in Adamonan, Tayabas, now. Quezon. On January to August 1945, local Filipino troops of the 5th, 51st, 52nd, 53rd, 55th, 56th and 57th Infantry Division of the Philippine Commonwealth Army and 5th Infantry Regiment of the Philippine Constabulary was liberated in Adamonan and helped the guerrilla resistance fighters under the marking. S. Guerrillas and the President Quezon. S. Own Guerrillas PQOG, and the American Liberating Troops of the United States Army 1st Cavalry Division and the 11th Airborne Division to fought against the Japanese forces and ended in World War II. Liberation and the Battle of Adamonan Beginning the liberation and the Battle of Adamonan on January to August 1945 between the fought the main battles of the combined U.S and Philippine Commonwealth Liberation Military Forces and aided the local guerrilla resistance fighters in defeating attack and fought against the Imperial Japanese Military Forces in Adamonan, Tayabas, now. Quezon. On January 1945, many strongholds of all local military forces of the Filipino soldiers and military officers under the Philippine Commonwealth Army 5th, 51st, 52nd, 53rd, 55th, 56th and 57th Infantry Division and Philippine Constabulary 5th Infantry Regiment has the sending the local military operations in the town of Adamonan, Tayabas from the local PCA and PC Military GHQ and Military Camp Bases in Tayabas Provinces 
forces and some parts in northern and southern Luzon and Bicol Peninsula was they recaptured and liberated the entered the town in Atamonan, Tayabas and aiding the local guerrilla resistance fighters under the call. Marking. S. guerrillas and the President Quezon. S. Own guerrillas PQOG, and attacking Japanese troops. From February to April 1945, the main battles and invading commands of all stronghold of local Filipino soldiers, military officers, tank commanders, military trucks and jeeps, military IFV. S. Artillery and mortars and many other military engagements under the 5th, 51st, 52nd, 53rd, 55th, 56th and 57th Infantry Division of the Philippine Commonwealth Army and the 5th Infantry Regiment of the Philippine Constabulary was around side by side in the town of Atamonan and they entered and they recaptured from the plains, rice fields, rivers and forests are destroyed and bombed and they recaptured and entering invasion around the town streets, old Roman Catholic churches, municipal town halls, town plazas and many others are destroyed in bombings and aiding the local guerrilla resistance under the call. Marking S. guerrillas and the President Quezon's own guerrillas PQOC, and defeated Japanese Imperial Army forces from the couple of three months of one year during the fighting for the liberation before the American troops was captured the town. On April 10, 1945, the American Liberation Military Forces under the 1st Cavalry Division and the 11th Airborne Division of the United States Army was captured in Atamonan, Tayabas and they helped in aiding the local Filipino ground troops under the Philippine Commonwealth Army and Philippine Constabulary Units and the local guerrilla resistance fighters and defeated and attacking Japanese soldiers. The re-establishment of the joint and combined military camps and bases of the Philippine Commonwealth Army, Philippine Constabulary and the United States Army was the military active on April 1945 in Atamonan during the fighting. On April to August 1945 after the capturing the American Liberation Forces in the town on last April, the joint and combined military forces of the Filipino soldiers under the Philippine Commonwealth Army 5th, 51st, 52nd, 53rd, 55th, 56th and 57th Infantry Division and Philippine Constabulary 5th Infantry Regiment, the local guerrilla fighters under the call. Marking. S. Guerrillas and the President Quezon. S. Own guerrillas PQOG, and the American soldiers under the United States Army units of the 1st Cavalry Division and the 11th Airborne Division was surrounded the main battles and invading commands from the couple of six months before the liberated fought side by side around the town in Atamonan and they surprise attack and entering Japanese Imperial Army forces. The local and combined military and guerrilla raid and invasion of the military general headquarters of the Imperial Japanese Armed Forces in Atamonan, Tayabas in 1945 and they recaptured and invaded by the all the combined U.S. In Philippine Commonwealth military forces including the local recognized guerrilla groups entering the Japanese military GHQs in the municipal town. After the local and joint military and guerrilla raid sieges of the Japanese military GHQs in Atamonan, many the combined U.S. and Philippine Commonwealth ground forces included with the local guerrilla resistance fighters was captured and taken the Japanese military GHQ in Atamonan and they surrendering Japanese Imperial forces. When the combined U.S. and Philippine Commonwealth ground forces included with the local guerrilla resistance fighters inside the capturing Japanese military GHQs has downed the flagpole raised of the Japanese flag of the Imperial Japanese military through the up the flagpole raised of the American and Philippine flag for the combined U.S. and Philippine Commonwealth military after the fighting the siege commands. The aftermath of the Battle of Atamonan on August 1945, the local and combined military and guerrilla resistance casualties was founded of the fighting and succeeding battles, sieges and invasions included the Filipino troops of the Philippine Commonwealth Army and Philippine Constabulary Units over 6,800 killed in action and 17,000 wounded in action, while the local guerrilla fighters under the call. Markings guerrillas and the President Quezon's own guerrillas PQOG, suffered over 480 killed in action and 1,743 wounded in action, the American troops of the United States Army over 2,800 killed in action over 5,320 wounded. 
On the part of the Japanese Imperial forces over 28,000 killed in action, 64,000 wounded in action and 7,900 captured in action, the combined U.S. and Philippine Commonwealth military ground forces with the local guerrilla groups was saluted and the successfully victories after the Battle of War and they captured in Atamonan, Tayabas. Demographics people from Atamonan are called Atamonanans. The primary language is Tagalog, with many local phrases and expressions. Manilans usually understand Atamonan Tagalog, albeit with some frustrations. Many Atamonanans are part Chinese or Spanish. Some Atamonanans can also speak Bicolano, Lan Nong, or Spanish. Religion The dominant religion in Atamonan is Roman Catholic. The culture in Atamonan is primarily ingrained in rural maritime Filipino settings. Other religions present are, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints LDS commonly known as Mormon, Atamonan United Christian Ministries Iglesia Ni Cristo Seventh-day Adventist Jehovah's Witnesses Philippine Independent Church, Iglesia Filipina Independiente, known as Aglipayans, Islam Our Lady of Angels Parish Our Lady of Angels Parish is a member of Roman Catholic Diocese of Lucena, Parish Priest, Rev. Monsignor. Emmanuel Ma. Burial Parochial Vicar, Rev. Fr. Warren R. Puno Parochial Vicar, Rev. Fr. Russell Habitat Parish of Our Lady of Angels, Philippine Independent Church, Parish Priest, Rev. Fr. Arnold Manalo de Mayan, BTH, BAPA Economy The economy of Atamonan is sustained by fishing and agriculture. Many also engage in seafaring. The town is part of the Tourism Highway Program of the Department of Tourism. Tourist attractions Quezon Protected Landscape Atamonan Feeder Port Panagbandarahan Summit Bantake Fall and Caves Atamonan Fish Port Atamonan Fish Sanctuary de Gracia Beach Floating Cottage Atamonan Bayview Resort Green Park Hotel and Resort Missy and Zane Hotel de Recepcion Villarreal Beach Ritza Beach Resort De Bay Resort Villa Urgino Beach Resort Tinindog Heights Quezon National Park Zigzag Park Festivals Tagaltal Festival Tagaltal Festival is an evolution of various cultural activities, practiced in previous years by Atamonanans. The town and patronal fiesta every August 1 and 2 is simply celebrated with the usual parade, a cultural program, Thanksgiving Mass and procession. In 1981, during the administration of then Quezon board member and then mayor of Atamonan Remedios v. Distro, an activity was started, the Caracol. It is a fluvial parade done in the afternoon of the second day of the fiesta. The boats traveled around Laman Bay within the boundaries of the town proper headed by the Grand Boat where the patron, Nuestra Señora de Los Angeles was aboard. There were singing, dancing and band playing, all in expression of gratitude to the Almighty for the year's bountiful catch. The parade then joined the religious procession and ended at the church. Later, it was done in the morning after the Thanksgiving Mass at the fishing port and boat racing competition followed after the caracol. The creation of the Lupong Tagapangasiwa ng Cultura at Signing Sa Atamonan under the leadership of Mr. Francisco T. Laude, a retired public school teacher, put new dimension and vigor to the town's cultural awareness and in the year 2003, the Tagaltal Festival was finally launched. Tagaltal, an old fishing method used by Atamonanans, was derived from the Tagalog word ugtol, meaning bounce. Tagaltal fishing consists of a rectangular stone tied at the end of abaca strings dip in honey. Thorns of calamansi and similar plants with bait were tied two feet above the stone before dipping in water and moved in a bouncing movements. The festival is a five-day celebration starting July 29 until August 2. The celebration is an array of both cultural and sports activities, talent and beauty contests participated by community organizations and individuals and headed by the Local Government's Culture and Arts Council LUPTAKSA, and Atamonan Tourism Council. Pabatan Festival Town of Atamonan celebrates the Pabatan Festival every May 15 in honor of the patron saint of farmers, Saint Isidore, almost the same in Lukban's Pahias Festival. During this festival, every house in the town proper has hanging decor such as vegetables, fruits, suman, dried fish wrapped in plastic and any other kinds of food, and when the statue of St. Isidore have passed the street, then the decoration will be thrown in the people who wants to have the decors. Education, Secondary and Tertiary, Private, Quezonian Educational College Inc. Our Lady of the Angels Academy, Allah, Leon Guinto Memorial College, Inc. ACEBA Science and Technology Institute, OSTI, Inc. 
College of Science, Technology and Communication CSTC, Inc. Secondary, Public, Adamonan National Comprehensive High School ANCHS. Malagaya National High School Malanao Alaya National High School Malusac National High School San Rafael National High School Elementary Primary, Private, Casa Dei Patino Montessori School Street Louis Kids World Learning Center Our Lady of the Angels Academy Elementary Department Little Angels Montessori Learning Center Adamonan United Methodist Christian School Inc. Public Adamonan Central School Adamonan Central School Annex Buhangan Elementary School Balubad Elementary School Karadad Ibaba Elementary School Analog Elementary School Magsaysay Elementary School Malagaya Elementary School Malanao Ibaba Elementary School Malanao Alaya Elementary School Malusak Elementary School Ponan Elementary School Rizal Elementary School San Rafael Elementary School Sapan Elementary School STA Catalina Elementary School Annex Tagbacan Elementary School Local government Municipal officials 2010 to 2013 Municipal mayor Jose F Mendoza Municipal vice mayor Joel M Vergano Municipal councilors Zeneda D Varango Renato C Sarmiento Celin S Distro Elmer M. Santander Maria Aurora A. Tamayo Nestor E. Santander John Francis L. Luzano Rosaler A. Magdabay PPLB President, Ernesto S. Amandi PPSK President, Lloyd John L. Vergano Municipal Officials, 2013-2016 Municipal Mayor, Jose F. Mendoza Municipal Vice Mayor, Joel M. Vergano Municipal Councilors Zeneda D. Varanga Rizaldi L. Velasco Renato C. Sarmiento Elmer M. Santander Inigo P. Mape Celan S. Distro Macayan Rosaler A. Magdabay John Francis L. Luzano PPLB President, Ernesto S. Amandi Municipal Officials, 2016-2019 Municipal Mayor, ENGR. Rustico Joven U. Mendoza Municipal Vice Mayor, Zeneda D. Varanga Municipal Councilors Elmer M. Santander Rizaldi L. Velasco Nestor E. Santander Estela A. Lim Rosaler A. Magdabay Maria Aurora A. Tamayo Nestor V. Laude Merlinda C. Pesigan PPLB President, Amato A. Vidal. References External links Official website of Adamonan Municipal Government Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information Local Governance Performance Management System